Back at 16 a moment ago. Here on you, second. Up the hill, 119. Just come off eagle at the previous hole. Oh, and nearly another one. Second for Aditya Shook at 10. 134 yards out of the rough. She's going to have to grip down. Oh, that's coming out very nice. Yeah, really well judged out of there. Yeah, and with the whole location in the back. And Knight, who was up by two, but not anymore. Out to the eighth. Ronin Yin, who won Palace Verdes recently. This to get it to seven under. So add another name, Morgan, to that list at seven under par. Nelly Corder. A second to the 11th. As we talked about yesterday, the difficulty of this hole changes dramatically. Now, Chaya Knight in a good position off the tee at the fifth. Oh, fabulous. Going down that left side. Really takes all the trouble out the, off the right out of play. This is an eight arm from 139. It's also an easier angle for the slope of the green. Well done. Left it below the hole. Nata Hataoka, a moment ago, she has won here at Wilshire Country Club. Different event, same golf course. Three under right now. Oh, right at it, and right below the hole, too, which is always good here. Nelly Corder, she's only two back. And that one's just going to miss on the low side. But she's had... A lot of near misses this this season and last week kind of summed up the year for me when I mean, she made that eagle putt at the last to get within one of the playoff back over to five Cheyenne Knight for birdie this is up the hill Tom nice first birdie of the day for the overnight leader up on the green page how about this for Hannah Green it shouldn't have too much movement yeah, well done. Two putt, tough hole today. This is at the par three seventh. Aditi Ashok, who had the lead coming into the weekend here. And she has this to tie Cheyenne Knight. And that is really well judged for speed. So Aditi Ashok looking for her second victory of the year. Got a long way to go here. 198 to the hole. This is on a really good line, though. Oh, this is terrific. Look at this. Wow, what a shot, Morgan. She's got 178 and a four on in her hands. There's a little bit of breeze into the player's face. So probably adding about 10 yards to this shot. She does hit a high ball, so this is a high fade. I got the kick. That'll leave it below the hole. Be a little bit of a slow putt up the hill. Xiu Lin at one under on the day. Here at the eighth moment ago, the approach. Good round yesterday, 66. Yeah, right over the top of it. Would you feel more pressure? Wasn't on the lead going into the final round. So I'm just going to keep doing what I've been doing. Stay within my routine. Same thought process. She admitted to that. Atidia shook this for birdie at eight. Hopped right away. Took that speed off. I like that little bit of a routine she's doing there to square her shoulders just a little bit before she takes the putter back. DT knows she's played really well up until yesterday. Had a little bit of a rough day, but still, she knows she's got the game. One of those here at eight for Aditya Shook for par. She was solid with them yesterday. One off the lead, Hannah Green, her second at the eighth. Just 94 yards really pushed her drive down here. Pole location in the front. Yeah, starting to come back. Have a good look at it to share the lead at eight under. Ronin Yin now. Second on the way at 10. All the way up top to that whole location. Have some break in it from there, though. Just ideally something. Five, ten feet left of this flag stick, Tom. 
ended up there. 15th hardest hole, third easiest hole, and you give away a three putt like that. Birdie try, Hannah Green on the way. Yeah, work back the other way. Still trying to figure out the greens. It's for birdie at 10. This should have a pretty good right to left break. A right, good read. This is the ninth, and this is Aditi Ashrop for a par. Stay at eight under. Good outward nine from Aditi. Second at the 11th for Ronan Ian. She leads the field, Tom, and greens in regulation so far this week. I feel like that's been a cor very correlating stat. Never know in LA. Par putt for Hannah Green at nine. Yeah, well done. She's hanging in there, has played well as she comes down the stretch here. One on the Po Greens at Palos Verdes, which is not too far away from here, maybe an hour's drive. Yeah. The ideal place to putt from. Had a club short there. Mm, left herself a little bit for par. One of the better rounds on the golf course, though. Four under on the day. It's going to be difficult to get this ball all the way to the hole because you don't want to leave yourself a three-footer behind it. Good putt. Yeah, you can't be too aggressive with that. She wasn't. Should tap in. Stay at seven under, one back. And plenty more just behind that. Yeah. Running in for par at 12. And now you've got yeah, a bit of a language barrier there between the two of them. Let's go to 10. A Didi for birdie. Said that one of the keys for her today was going to be hitting it closer, giving herself more birdie opportunities. That was a good one there. It's tough. Morgan, it is not an easy finishing hole. No, the hole location today, maybe the most generous of the week. Take that lightly, though. It's still not very generous. What a shot here from Pernilla. Got to carry those bunkers. Green runs away from you diagonally and then a steep drop off to the left. And you were correct. Out of a divot, 136 yards. She was rehearsing a punch swing. Guaranteed solid contact. That was excellent. Oh, yeah. Wow. Hop it over the edge of the bunker. Out of that lie, Tom. That was wonderful. The 13th is a par five. And move the team back for the final round. Ronan Yin's third shot. Flag tucked to the back of this narrow green. And that's a really good one. Yeah, and she's going to have to manufacture something up through the fringe in order to get this anywhere near the hole. Took a nice hop. Look at that. Wonderful imagination. The left rider to almost help it break. Was that quick down the hill? Fair way at 10. Second from Knight. And this is a nine iron. It's got a little draw into that wind. Beauty. Ayaka Fudaway added another, another name to the list. That's got a chance here. Seven under and one off the lead. Oh, just. It's going to end up great. What a bounce. I know. Yeah. Well, two of the Chinese players in the Hanwha Life Plus International Crown for China are on the leaderboard. Xi Yu Lin being one of them. Five. Did you like Kings Barnes, right? I, I love the name. Love the golf course. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> Good pop out there. Have you ever been, either one of you, to the Kentucky Derby? Easy birdie. And it would have been easy with those early bogeys. To, up at 18, Jarvi Boonchant left her second in the bunker. Has a bogey putt coming up. Food away on the way. There it is. Brilliant finish, 65, which matches the best we've seen today.
Second short par four, 14 running in. Whole location today, all the way in the back right. Wonderful shot. 14th running in, excellent approach. And sole possession of the lead at nine under, five under on the round. No problem. Adidia Shook moved the coin back. Stays at eight under, got the par five next. She gained or learned from winning just down the road recently at Palos Verdes was, I belong here. And I think that we're seeing that in her play today. You know, yeah, she knows yeah. that she's won out here. That's going to fall down just to the bottom of that slope, but still going to leave her an eagle attempt. Just an inside right putt here. Needs to be firm with this one. Yeah! Got to commit to that, don't you? Those five, six foot putts. Yeah. Three to play. That one just missing out there from Aditi Ashok at the 13th. The 18th hole playing a little easier today than it has done on previous days. A pretty good two putt. Not much st stress after the birdie attempt. 13th, her third shot. She's Four got a much better. today, Morgan. Yeah, much better angle here from where Hannah played oh, from. Massive bounce. 126 yards. Whole location in the back. Only four paces behind it. Well done. That's a good spot to putt from there, Terry. Landed up right where you talked about. Hannah Green for birdie at 13. Break the par streak? No. Up to 18. Birdie tried to finish up Nelly Corda. Finished with an eagle last week. Finishes with a birdie this time around. 14 the third for Shiyu Lin going over the bunker. It's a tough shot because you can't really see the green surface. Tough to judge the distance control, but Janet made it look really easy there. Not going to take anything for granted. These putts, three, four, five footers. Hannah Green looking for some birdies. Second at 14. She stuffed it in here yesterday. Up on the green, Hannah Green still in search of a birdie. Got to take the cellophane off the hole here. Oh, nope. Still there. <laughs> I thought that was going to be the one. Yeah. Wow. Cars throughout the day. A flag at the back of the green on a shelf that sits up. And the miss here would be just a little bit right of the flag stick. Yeah, it's going to settle in the bottom tier. She's going to have a chance to get some height, additional height. Fringes have been very unpredictable. Oh, scooped it. Scooped it just, just enough. No, knew it right away. She'll fall to nine under par. A DTS shock will have that putt just a short distance away. And it is very close at the top of the leaderboard as we go to 14 and Cheyenne Knight's putt. She makes it. 
So Cheyenne Knight with a birdie at 14. We talked about this area of the golf course. And every time, Tom, we felt like somebody has been in control of this tournament. <laughs> Allison Lee. For birdie. So many fans out here watching her this week. We got all revved up and solid final round. She learned to get it up and down at 15, so she's to eight under par. Second at the 15th. She got this well past it's a big the drive. crosswalk. Yeah. Haven't really seen anybody on that side of the crosswalk today. Just get it to sit down on the top level. There you go. Plenty of green to work with. Not a ridiculous amount of speed, but just something to think about. I think she had the line, just ran out of pace. However, it's par at 16, and she will stay at nine under the trouble for Cheyenne. Knight at 15. We come down the stretch here at the JM Eagle. Big deficit to recover from. Let's go to 16. And don't forget about Hannah Green, just one back. Look for a second birdie of the day. That's exactly what you've got to do. You've got to try and gather yourself, get, get some composure here now, because it's, it's very easy to feel completely flattened by what's happened. And under the circumstances, this is tremendous. This is a moment ago. You for an eagle. Here, the lovely three hybrid two here, up and over that tier. No, there she goes. Gets it to six under par, recovers. Well, we've seen the 17th claim some victims over the years. Think of Jin Young Ko, think of Inby Park going into the Barranco. We don't expect it at 15. Shi Yu Lin second at 17. 170 to the hole from here. Good angle. This is not a good line. Well, don't write off Shi Yu Lin just yet. She's going to give herself a short birdie putt as. Clustered, walking off of that tee. Here's Aditi's third. Oh, all about that bounce. And it just wandered away. And so the lead goes back to eight under par, and there are four players tied here in the LA Championship. And make it five players at the top. on an aggressive line. Just does clear the bunker. What a great look to get it to nine under. We've been watching her on the LPGA Tour for a decade now, looking to break through with a win. If she takes it just right of the flag. How about those two shots? <laughs> Hannah Green's third. Got to chip it over those sprinklers, maybe fly it all the way to the green. And that is a great touch. Yep. Nine under par. Two in the clubhouse at nine under here at Wilshire Country Club. This to get it to nine under, join them in the playoff. Any putt goes in today, this would be a nice one right here. What a nice time to find it. Wow. 
second birdie all day. Get iron again. Going right. And that one gets the kick. I think that might have landed about two feet from where her first one landed. Just about. Were made by what she did. I mean, they just went through the roof with regards to golf and searching for golf. This is high. It's on a good line. Very similar to what she did also in regulation. Oh, this is pretty good. Or maybe no pressure. Just like in regulation, catches that low lip, sneaks it in. Clutch, clutch putt. Money. Never a doubt. How easy did she make that 18 hole look? Same club that she used just a few minutes ago. This is another beauty. Just on automatic right now. It's really soft sand underneath the ball. This to win it. Took extra time, but Hannah Green wins the inaugural JM Eagle LA Championship. Her third win on the LPGA Tour. On a day, we talk about patience, and it, it's kind of a boring word. I mean, she needed plenty of patience today. Yeah, she exuded patience on this golf course today. It was only a matter of time before she would win.